Alright folks, this is a quick tutorial on how to install a custom boot animation on your EVO 3D. Um, really easily actually. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. First thing you want to do is you want to install a uh, root explorer type of app. I actually use eStrong's file explorer right up there. Um, and with this app you want to make sure that you uh, turn into root mode. So let's see, settings. Go to it says right there. Root Explorer. So a boop. Okay. Granted uh, super user permissions. That's cool. Whatever. Now, once that's done, then you want to go to. Oh, and you probably want to also download your custom boot animation.zip file as well. Then you go to your phone partition, you find where it says system, system, then customize, then resource, and then find out where it says sprint boot animation. Oh, right past it. Let's see, there it is, sprint boot animation. Now what I'm gonna do, just in case, take that, and I'll cut. I'm gonna go back to my SD card and I'll put it in a backup folder. Backup. And paste. Wait for it to finish pasting. Remember it says sprint with a capital S underscore boot animation dot zip. Then you take your custom boot animation, copy, go back to your system, customize, resource directory, and paste it. Let's paste it. You find it. There it is, and you rename it. Let me go ahead and just pick a for this. Let's see. Name and rename it. Sprint with a capital S. Score root animation dot zip. Okay. Double we'll check to make sure it's correct. There it is. Sprint boot animation. Zip. All right. Now that that's taken care of, go back. Scan. All right. Just really quick. Start your phone just to make sure it worked. Normal. Sometimes it takes a minute. There's your custom boot animation. Now this one actually wasn't the right size, but I just thought it looked kind of cool. Plus, you know, whatever. Anyway, but that's how you do it. Now remember, your root explorer has to be, uh, <clears throat> you have to remember to put into root mode and then also make sure that you mount the system partition as writable. So that way you're able to edit those files and those directories. Um, 
Aside from that, that's how you do it. Enjoy. Enjoy.